All right, man. It's time for the entire D line to get their shine. Dominated the Bucks, so we just rolling out more videos of this defensive line going crazy. David Anyamata, as he pronounced it on Sunday Night Football, he's up next, man. Absolute stud D tackle. His best game of the season combined with Cam Jordan's best game of the season. It's a reason we pitched the shutout, and we just gonna jump in right here, man. Just look at the way he drives this guy back, man. It's I'm just stronger than you, like, you know? Nothing you can do. Gets his hands on Tom Brady, puts Tom Brady on the ground. The one thing you know about Tom Brady, he doesn't like to be touched. He likes to, he likes to get the ball out quick. Doesn't want anyone to touch him. The more you touch him, the, the worse he plays throughout the night. So getting, you know, hands on him early, early, early in the game, it's just, it's just huge. All right, this next play. Boom, at the start right here, he's already getting double teamed. It's a couple of double teams I'll put in here because I just want to show y'all, you know, the difference when he takes on a double team and someone else takes on a double team and some things like that. But he's getting double team right here, fights off. The guy tries to move up, makes the tackle. Only a three-yard run by the Bucks. That's promise. It, it looks like it's nothing, but it's an absolute lot. Uh, here's another look. Once again, just the strength. Like, Jesus Christ, man. Jesus. Right here, directly over the center. Takes on that left guard. And, I mean, he just, he drives him back into Tom Brady. Like, like I haven't seen. That's, that's kind of what Davenport does. Insane, insane by Anya Mata right there. I don't know what Lattimore was doing right there. He had him covered, and then he just kind of stopped. But, hey, that's neither here nor there. All right, this play here. This play is huge. We're going to watch it. Then we'll talk about it. But I'll I'll break this down just in a little more detail than the, the first couple plays. Right, I believe this is the third quarter. The Bucks haven't had anything going, and... They're just throwing the ball basically every play, but they ran it on this play. And if you pause it right here, look at, look at Davenport, look at Cameron Jordan. They are taking straight pass first. They're not playing the run at all. They've both been hot. They're looking for sacks. They're looking for sacks. And so they're both just rushing upfield. Actually a great, great, great play call by the Bucks right here to just hit them with kind of a little draw. Could you just look across the, the board right here? Um, Demario Davis has a blocker. Quan Alexander has a blocker. And we just watched those two. Boom. Both of those guys get blocked right here. And they may they may have something. But you have to give credit to these D tackles. Because this, this could be a 20, 30-yard run. He beats the safety. He might score. You never know what can happen. But Anyamata and Tuttle. Anyamata mostly gets gets his hands on him. Takes him down. Stops that, you know, three-yard run. That could be a big, big play right there. Uh, for the Bucks, didn't happen. Great job by Anyamata. And Tuttle. Got to give him credit there. But speaking of Tuttle, we're going to watch this play. Uh, Anyamata makes a tackle right here. Him and Davenport. But what I what I want y'all to watch on this play is watch Shy Tuttle. We've been seeing Anyamata take on these double teams uh, a couple times now. Now watch when Tuttle do it right here, and watch how different it looks. You see Tuttle shaking on, taking on that double team compared to, you know, uh, Anyamata most games. He makes it look easy, but I promise you, when two 320 pounds, six three, six four, whatever men are pushing you, it's tough to, to hold your ground right there. It's super, super tough. I'm not taking any shots at Tuttle because he had a, he had a good game here as well, but. Anyamata just makes it look easy. I promise those double teams are not easy to take on. And he did he, I mean, he did an excellent job all game of it. It was plenty more I could have put in there. But, you know, didn't want to make this too, too long. Uh, this is the last play. He got a sack here. We'll watch it. Then we'll talk about it. Once again, once again. This guy, Marcus Davenport, does a lot that does not show up in the stat sheet at all. We're just going to watch Marcus Davenport right here. 
He's not even rushing the pass. So he has to do his job. And if he does his job, it's going to lead to a free sack. Look at him. He dives inside. Now watch this push. Boom. Pushes on your mother free. Then takes on the, the other blocker right there. He's got a sack. Excellent play design. Look at this guy throwing his hands up like, what the hell, man? You supposed to help me? Da, 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 da. Nothing illegal is about, you know, Davenport pushing you. Just perfect. Perfect, 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 perfect by Davenport. You literally have to push this guy out the way and then get, get back contacted, you know. Make contact with the guy that's supposed to block you. Now you're screwed. On your mother, free sack. Thanks to Davenport right there. Excellent play. Look, Davenport even knows at the end. He throws his hands up right there. He knows he did his job. It won't ever show up in the stat sheet. Fans won't give him credit for it or bloggers or, you know, whoever. They say, oh, we only have four or five sacks this year. The man is a beast. But shout out to Anyamai. It was a real, real good game from him. I had him in the top ten Saints players this year. He hasn't been that, but this is his best game. Hopefully he can build on that. Hopefully Cam Jordan can build on that because those guys can show up with a healthy Davenport. We can rush three all game, to be honest. Like it, it, They're that good. We may be able to do that, you know, in some cases. So, we'll see. Uh, like I said, we need to build on this defensive line. Best portion of this team. When they're all going, can't be stopped. But that's David on your mother, man. I'll have some more film breakdowns from this Bucks game. Uh, and just stay tuned in. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good jazz. Turn those notifications bells on. If you subscribe, do not forget to hit that notification bell. That's going to just, you know, let you know when I drop a video, these film breakdowns, if you like that, or just like me talking, you'll, you'll catch the vibe. But this is the Boot Tragedies, and I'm out.